Newton's law of restitution. Try this question yourself. When you have done it, then watch the clip. Your left hand side, we write the equation of momentum. So 3 kilograms, speed is 4. So we got 3 times 4. And the second sphere. So the motion to the left. We're going to call it negative. So minus 4 times 6 is equal to 3 times the velocity of A plus 4 times velocity of B. So we write here 3a, the velocity of a, plus 4 times the velocity of b. This is 12 minus 24 is minus 12. So this is our equation 1. This side. We write the equation of restitution. Separation speed is equal to the coefficient of restitution times approach speed. So separation speed is minus velocity of A plus velocity of B. Restitution coefficient is 0 0.4 and the approach speed here is 4 plus 6 is 10. So we've got velocity of A minus velocity of A plus velocity of B is equal to 4. So if you times this equation by 3, we get 3 velocity of A times 3 plus to b equal to 12. That's equation 2. So we'll write equation 2 here minus 3 plus to 5 plus 3 plus to b equal to plus 12. To eliminate velocity of a, we add the equations. So this is eliminated. We got 7 times velocity of b minus 12 plus 12 is 0. So therefore velocity of b is 0 i is the stationary after the impact. Then we use this equation here. It's 3 times the velocity of A plus 4 times 0 equal to minus 12. Then we divide. So we've got the velocity of A equal to minus 4. And now it's in the opposite direction to which it was travelling first. It was moving to the right first, now it's moving to the left. Second part, loss of kinetic energy. So initial kinetic energy is equal to half the mass of the first object was 3 times speed was 4 so half mb squared plus the other object speed was 6 so 
So this 16 divided by 2, 8 times 3 is 24. 36 times 2. So the initial kinetic energy was 96 joule. Final kinetic energy is equal to half mass of A, which is 3, times this velocity, which is 4, squared. So the negative sign doesn't mean anything because we're going to square it. So we always get a positive answer. Plus half times the object B is 4 if the velocity is 0. So this is 24 joules. So therefore loss and kinetic energy is bigger answer minus the smaller answer seventy two joule.